let's look at an example on ungrouped data. Example 1. The following information relates to the performance of some students in BBA in a statistics test, a coursework test. So these are the marks 2, 3, 6, 9, 11, 3, 5, 3, 2. These are the marks. The data is not grouped. It is just they have just given us the max. So they want us to determine A, determine the mean, B, mod, median, range, mid, sorry, not median deviation, mean deviation. This is mean deviation, then variancy, then standard deviation, and lastly, Coefficient of variation. Coefficient of variation. So we are going to have the solution. We shall first deal with the three mean, mod, and median, since the the, the measures of central tendency. We shall first deal with the measures of central tendency. Then later we shall handle the rest, which are the measures of dispersion or variation. So. Measures of central tendency, we, we said that there are mainly three, and that is mean, mode, and median. So we shall start with mean, Roman 1, Roman 1, they wanted us to determine mean, so we shall start with the mean. Mean, and the formula for mean for ungrouped data is summation x out of n, whereby x represents the observations and n represents the number of observations so according to the question the marks that they gave us are the ones that we call x these ones the our x so we shall get them to this plus three plus six nine eleven three five two like that so they are what we take as our x. Then n, we say it is the number of observations. We count the observations. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So the observations are 9. Therefore our n is 9. So we add them out of 9. If we add on the calculator, we put in 2 plus 3, plus 6, plus 9, plus 11, plus 3, plus 5, plus 3, plus 2, we get 44. 44, then we divide by 9, we get 4.888. If we round off, we get 4.9. So our mean for this ungrouped data, it is 4.9. Then the Roman 2, Roman 2, they wanted us to determine mod. Mod for ungrouped data refers to that item that appears more than once. Or that, that, that appears the most times, that appears frequently, more frequent than other items. So we are seeing three here, three here, and then three here. It has appeared three times. There is no other number that has appeared more than three times. So mean be a mean mod. Our mod is three. So three becomes our mod because it has appeared more than it, it has appeared three times. It has appeared frequently than any other figure. Then Roman theory, they want us to determine the median. Median for ungrouped data, it refers to that middle item that is in the middle. So the thing that we are supposed to do is to arrange from lowest to highest or from highest to lowest. Any can work. So we have 2, 2, then 3. It appeared 3 times, then 5, 6, 9, and then 11. So we look out for the middle item. 2 cancels with 11, 
this cancels with this this cancels with this this cancels with this and the middle item with this so 3 becomes our median because it's the one that is in the middle so our median for this ungrouped data is 3 so this has been ungrouped data for me measures of central tendency in the next video we shall be continuing to finish the remaining measures thanks for watching